So the Giants have signed Kyler Fackrell to a one-year, $6.5 million deal. He is an edge rusher from the Green Bay Packers. He's joining his buddy Blake Martinez to be a New York football giant. He's coming over, and he is fresh off of a one-and-a-half sack season, and that doesn't sound too good, but let me pull his stats up right here. Uh, 2018, he had 10 and a half sacks, which is really good, and it pretty much shows that he has that potential to get double-digit sacks. And Marcus Golden kind of reminds me of Marcus Golden, to be honest. A guy that had double-digit sacks who had a down year. And now he's going to have the chance to come to the Giants and get a prove-it deal. We'll see if Marcus Golden comes back to the team. Uh, we'll see. I'm looking up his other stats. Uh, he had a three-sack season, a two-sack season, a one-sack season, and a ten-and-a-half season. So... He obviously hasn't been a consistent 10 and a half sack guy, but just that he has that potential, I'm pretty excited to see him here. Pro Football Focus, the way they track their players, you can put as much credence in this as you want. Pro Football Focus had him as like one of the most improved players last year in the second half of the season. And I don't know how he was used particularly on the Packers. I'll have to look more into that because obviously the Smith brothers were coming off the edge. So maybe he got shifted inside. He doesn't have a high amount of tackles, so it just looks like he just wasn't used much or he might have been injured. But it's an interesting signing. It's a low-budget signing, and it's a signing that is has a potential to really pay off, kind of like Marcus Golden did. And then if we can bring back a Marcus Golden, we'll have two solid guys who have gotten double-digit sacks and just give everybody else a chance to grow as somebody from the draft. Robert Quinn got a five-year, $70 million deal. We really weren't going to pay him that. It's essentially a $2 million deal. I, I think they'll be out of that deal in two years, but uh, we'll see how this goes. Kyler Fackler to the New York Giants. That's my raw reaction.